welcome to Women in Tech. How do you feel? It's, it's good to see all of you. This is the third time we're doing this, and this is also the third time I'm doing this with you guys. And it's, it's, it's wonderful to be here. You know, I, I, uh, there are things in life that you, um, that you just uh, love to do, and, and there are three groups in, in my life that, well, I, I just cannot say no to these groups. And the number one group are women. <laughs> the second group are young people and immigrants. And if you're a, and if you're a, a young female immigrant, basically I'm working for you, okay? You know, that, I, I just cannot, I cannot say no. Because I believe in diversity, ladies and gentlemen, and I really believe that it's something that drives our businesses to a sustainable future. And I, uh, I understood really the, the power of diversity, uh, believe it or not, here in Finland, and because what happened to me 17 years ago is that I fell in love with a Finnish woman. You know, what can you do from Savo? You know, <laughs> shit happens, you know. I mean, what can, what can you do? And, uh, but she taught me a lot of valuable things about diversity and equality that, I, that have made me who I am today. First thing that she, that she taught me the hard way is that, you know, I'm, I'm, uh, I'm half Italian. I'm uh, French-Canadian originally. I moved to Finland almost 20 years ago. And, but uh, still, she taught me something valuable about di diversity is... You know, I, I decided when I, when I met her at the School of Economics here that uh, I would, you know, she's the one for me. So, you know, I, I, I decided I would propose to her my way, you know, my sales pitch my way from, you know, from my perspective. And what I did is that I, I, I got a, a suite from the, uh, the Camp Hotel. It's a beautiful hotel here. And I, and I put uh, candles and flowers everywhere. I had put a table for two there and... I had a guitar with me. I had written a song for this event. I know this is a disgusting story for most Finnish men. I know. <laughs> but there's, that, there's, a, there's a point in my, in my story. And, uh, and this is the, the, the sales pitch of my life. There she is, my, my Savo line. And I, I'm there with my guitar and my mother's ring. And I, I'm in front of her and I say, would you marry me? And I, I'll never forget what she said, you know. She said, Andre, yes, I accept your offer. <laughs> That's a very cold, ad. I wasn't expecting that. And then she goes into, you know, finance finish mode, and she says, by the way, why did you waste all this money? You know? And then, after a wonderful night, she wakes up and there's poison in the room, the kind of poison we have in the tech industry as well. It's poison to, for development, and it's called prejudice. It was in, was, you know, I, I, I had the, the honor of speaking to, uh, to the leaders of, uh, you know, our, our greatest tech company. We have our, our, our its chairman speaking to us soon. Nokia, when, when Nokia bought Alcatel, I was giving a, a dinner speech. And I, it, was, it was a wonderful, wonderful event where, where, you know, the huge diversity in such a, in such a corporation is a great asset, especially after buying Alcatel and, and, and making it what it is today, a completely transformed company, a highly diverse company. But diversity is only useful if you're able to manage and lead it and understand it and fight prejudice. And you know, there are, there's a lot of prejudice uh, in, 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 uh, in, the, in the tech field, and, and, and in this case, that, mo that morning, there was prejudice in the air because, of course, my new fiance, she had accepted my offer, of course, she had accepted my offer, but, uh, but there was prejudice, you know, and uh, she wakes up and she says, hey, are you serious about me? <laughs> say, hey, baby, you know, you know, I got the flowers, got the ring, wrote the song, you know, I'm saying, but, you know, of course, she had taken my picture to Savo, to her mummy, very strong, you know, in the Finnish culture. Your grandmother is a big, strong, powerful figure. And, uh, and she tried to explain, you know, this is André Nalchaker, he's a... Uh, He's a lawyer now, uh, you know, a finance major. Now, he, he just got a job as the CEO of a tech company, in, in, you know, uh, and they work, you know, with Nokia. And he's, you know, as they say in Finnish, you know, 
But then, but then grandma looks at my picture and she says, Damnen and gigolo. This kind of gigolo, you know. You know, don't go with him anywhere, you know. You know, he's going to leave you in two days. And then two days became two weeks, two weeks, two months, two months, two years, two years, two children, two children, two houses. And then 16, 16 years later, last year, Mumi looks at me in the eyes at the Sukuryukla and she says, you know, you know, it's a miracle that you're still with my little daughter. You know, you know, some prejudices don't die hard. We need to fight them. Yeah. But I'll never forget this invitation, this invitation to, uh, to, to succeed where she said, you know, Andre, I've got to tell you the truth. Your finish is shit. And I said, I, I know, but finish is hard. It's brain damage, babe. I mean, I can't do it. I said, well, from now on, if you're serious about me, this is your invitation, your diversity invitation to success. From now on, we speak only Finnish to each other. And I said, baby, I can't do it. It's brain damage, really, it's hard. And, and she looks at me and she says, Otsatosi, sasi. You know, are you serious? Okay, fine, I'll try my best. And this was 2002, and I'll never forget, 2012, I get a phone call from the speakers forum, they say, you know, now, Andre, hey, Congratulations, you've been just voted Speaker of the Year in Finland in Finnish. And I said, yeah, very funny. And I hung up and they called me again. We're serious. And I said, God bless the woman in my life. Thank you. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, I want to make sure that you're, you're awake. So whenever I say... We want more, you answer today, women in tech. Are you ready? We want more! We want more! You are awake. I've got to be checking your, your level of, 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 uh, of energy to, uh, throughout the day. Now, we have uh, wonderful partners for our day. Look at these. Look at how many partners we have. Let's give them a big hand. They believe in women in tech. The way... The way I want you to repay, our, to repay our wonderful partners is to go and talk to them about how they are changing our future, how they are creating wonderful technologies to transform the way we live and to make the world a better place. These are fantastic companies. Please go there, challenge them, ask them, be aware of what they're doing, and that's the best way we can repay them for being a part of this. Also, I want you to be very active. We can take a look at the... Uh, at, uh, well, first of all, the free Wi-Fi. Thank you, Finlandia Hall. No password. Very nice. And then hashtag is hashtag wit17, hashtag women in tech FI. And our event site, our event site is the mwall.mobi. Slash wit. And you have this information also here on your, on your tag. All right. Um, have I said everything? I'm looking at the organizers. Am I good that I say everything, that I go through all the slides? I've been good. I have 13 seconds to go to, to tell you that we have um, a fantastic opening for you, ladies and gentlemen. He is somebody who's, who believes in diversity in tech. Uh, I, I love to say that you know, Finland's largest company, largest, also the largest tech company, has, a, has an Indian CEO. It's wonderful. We're very diverse. It's great. And in many ways uh, has, uh, has paved the way to great transformation in technology. This company, only four or five years ago, was only a sixth of what it was in its market cap and 15 times, 20 times smaller in terms of its uh, enterprise value. And, and um, this great entrepreneur, uh, an icon of, uh, of the tech industry actually here in this country, will be speaking to us this morning. Um, but I'm out of time, so I'm just gonna say his name. He's the chairman of the board of directors at Nokia. Nisto Silasma, tervetuloa, welcome!